Hey, we have here today an interesting integral from MIT Integration B 2014, problem 15. We have the integral of the square root of x squared minus 1 over x dx. What I wanted to do is actually kind of focus in on this numerator and see if we can do something with this, manipulating it algebraically. So let's rewrite this. Instead of writing this as a square root, I'm going to write it as x squared minus 1, just to the 1 power. And then we can write this as over x squared minus 1. Just noticing like if there was a 1 power here and this is a half, if you divide those you get back to a half power, the same what we have there. Then let's not forget our x and then because we have a subtraction here we can actually split this into two integrals. So we can write this as x squared over x, x squared minus 1 dx and then we get a minus sign dx x squared x squared minus 1. And then the beauty of this is we're going to get a cancellation here as we have x over x squared, so we can just cancel one of these out. And I think this is going to work with a u substitution. And this thing, we don't have to do anything with this, but this is that integral is actually just secant inverse of x. You could do the trig substitution, but it's a standard integral. So then I'll focus on this first integral. And what I'm going to do is let's make a u substitution here. I'm going to call my u x squared minus 1. I think you could do it by making it a whole square root, but I kind of like doing it this way. And then our du is going to be 2x dx. Just to make this match exactly, I'm going to create a 2 right here and multiply by a 1 half in front. And so now we can make our substitution. Let's do this. We're going to have 1 half du in the numerator, and then we're just going to have the square root of u. Then I'm just going to write this as a uh, exponent so we can use the just makes it easier to use the power rule so I'll write this as u to the minus one half du and then we'll integrate one half u power rule one half times a two in front and this is just going to be square root of u okay so all that's left to do is kind of put this together and finish it off so we're going to have for this first integral we're going to have square root of u I'm going to back substitute with our our u, so we're gonna have square root x squared minus one minus this integral, which is just secant inverse x plus c, and we're done. That's it, MIT 2014, problem 15. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. Have a great day.